hello everyone welcome to gmail tutorials in this video we will see that how can we send images videos or any other files directly through google chat so for those of you who don't know google chat is actually a messenger like app service provided by google we can register in google chat directly from our gmail account only and using the gmail account we can chat with people uh, all over the world by just knowing their email addresses once we know their email address we can interact with them just like in a messenger like fashion which makes the conversations clean simple easy to use and easy to understand we do not require to set up an email thread that involves a lot of protocols for sending messages from one place to another it also requires a lot of efforts lot of steps those all are eliminated when we just want a one to one interaction between uh, us and other person so in this video we will see that since messengers like facebook instagram or uh, whatsapp has the feature of uh, sending or receiving the multimedia files so how can we do that using google chat and also we will see a side by side comparison that how easy it is to send those uh, media files in comparison to a normal email okay so without any further ado let us just dive right into the topic this is our uh, google chat which we have opened for us and between a particular person suppose we want to send some images to them we are already chatting with them okay and we want to send some multimedia files let's say images to them so what do we do we just come to this place over here where it says upload files and here we can just actually choose our files so let's just say this one once we have uh, chosen we can click on open so now what happens is it will show us a preview we can add some message also over here so let us just say for your consideration something like this and press enter so now this um, image has been sent to them for your consideration okay if we click on this image then what happens is we will get to see a big version of this image plus there would be a download icon that allows us to actually download this image okay so we can download it we can use it we can reproduce it we can share it with somebody else as well now similarly if to the same email id let me just copy their email id i want to send this image but as a email address or an email what do i do i first go to email i select this compose in the recipients i just type their email address or basically paste it i need to add a subject the subject is image file okay then uh, as i wrote there for your consideration so here also i will write for your consideration so since it is a smart compose so i can simply just put a tab and then i can attach the file so how do i attach that if it is copied i can simply paste it over here since it's not i go to this pin icon that allows me to attach the files and this image i select click on open i wait for it to upload once it's uploaded i cannot see its preview right if i just click on that then this image would be downloaded which would actually create an extra copy into my pc and take extra space which i don't want okay so there is no way for me to see the preview i am going to trust that okay i selected the correct file click on send then click on view message here i will be able to see the preview of the image once it's been sent then only i would be able to see the preview of the image if i open it okay the preview is there so this is a side by side comparison uh, of sending now what happens on receiving end so this is my receiving end uh in the case of a chat i can simply just check this image i can instantly give my reaction to this image okay so here is the reaction bar i can i let's say i like this image 
so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna add a reaction uh, let's say a thumbs up so or maybe this smart icon this i have added as my reaction okay sunglasses face in the case of email i go to my inbox i say that okay there is one email that i have received i open that email then i would be able to see just this part of the image if we want to see the preview of the image i have to click on that image this whole image would be opened and i would be able to see its preview now if i want to add any reaction i cannot directly add an emoji reaction i need to click on reply here i need to just clear it out this all extra things that are automatically added this i need to clear out by pressing control a and backspace then i can just uh, add my reaction so here is the emoji so let us just add the emoji only for the reaction and this would be the smart classes okay click on send then my reaction would be sent so this is a side by side comparison of a google chat and a gmail how many steps you need to perform in each of them that's it for this video thanks for watching